Hello, this is a short video about a graph visualization tool which makes use of a graph built with pool party semantic suite. So in this example we are going to look at a graph about cocktails. On the left hand side you see different classes uh, and by that you can start to uh, filter out uh, resources from the graph. So you could say, for instance, I'm only interested in uh, drinkware and um, by that you get a list of available uh, types of drinkware. Uh, now I could uh, start to fetch stuff from here. So for instance, the margarita class, which now is one of the first uh, initial entrance points into my graph uh, by clicking on this uh, icon here on the right hand side I can fetch next uh, best resources which are connected to margarita class for instance is used by so here you see two different uh, cocktails which make use of that I can always rearrange the layout by clicking on the layout button so you see those two have uh, margarita class in use next one could be uh, for instance looking up margarita and find out what it consists of which is those ingredients here so I can select those so you see it consists of control and other ingredients now I could take as a next step for instance again uh, what else is using control so I see here it's not just margarita but also Singapore sling I can select that one again and again I can look up what else uh, is making uh, is, is uh, Singapore Sling using so I see there's another uh, seven ingredients and then I learn uh, also for instance that uh, it's not just Singapore Sling which is using for instance this ingredient but also the planter sponge and so on so you start to see the uh, relations between the selected entities uh, so the whole uh, view on the graph is getting more and more complex and by that of course people start to understand more about the domain it's kind of a knowledge discovery tool so yeah this is an add-on to pull party semantic suite to visualize graphs uh, as a result you can also download those if you like uh, or print them out even and uh, also make them usable for further discussions. Thank you for your attention and your interest.